performing the duties of his office of Digby C. Caesar. No. Well, hey, everybody. Thanks for stopping by. I am Digby, and today we are back in the long drive with proper Christine. Now, I did reload an earlier save. This was right before we took off to try and find the stuff to clean up that Christine. So I don't remember if I have. I do not. Okay, I need to steal two hubcaps off of this, Christine. But yeah, I just wanted to give us a shot at maybe coming back someday and having this car still be here. Because you never know. Maybe I will... Whoops. All right, stand up. Maybe I will actually figure out what caused her to gain her powers properly. And we can imbue this one with superpowers as well, which would be like a dream. I mean, this is the perfect, like, dream car I wanted to find. Oh, for God's sakes. Are you really going to make me go all the way around the horn to grab a hubcap? I know there's at least one more in here that's in halfway decent shape. You know what? Throw it out that way. Jump back out here. Tell me you can find it in the field now, dum-dum. Um... Oh, I think... Thank you, autosave. Never mind, I found it. If it was a snake, it would have bit me. Alright, Christine, darling, I know you don't care about him, but I do. Oh, for God's sakes, the hubcaps are fighting me again. Alright, there. You've got four hubcaps. You are basically a couple of sponges away from mint condition. Oh, it actually almost physically hurts to leave that Christine behind, but needs must when the devil drives. Like I said, hopefully it'll be here on the trip home. Uh, I have no idea, actually, if the cars will respawn or not. Uh, I suppose we'll find that out in... Well, probably about 50 episodes at the rate we're moving. <laughs> Alright, well, let's go get up to a smidgen of shenanigans and maybe a touch of trouble. And see what's waiting for us down the road. Okay, the road's back to being this weird, crooked stuff again. I don't like it. Is there anything coming up ahead? No. From the, oh, what the hell happened there? Okay, the world's being really weird today. Okay, hold on. Ah, Jesus Christ. Yes, bumps. Ah. Okay, get me off of this, please. Just, can we go back to normal roads? I don't know what psychopath designed this, but holy crap. I hope he's not allowed to have sharp pencils. Oh, sh Well, that took a year off my life. Okay, well, we've got a pillbox coming up. Holy crap, I just realized how fast I'm going. Okay, there goes the pill... Shit! Oh! Um, Christine, baby, please don't lose your hubcaps. Oh, you've lost one. Alright, e-brake, e-brake. Well, it's going to be somewhere between here and the store, right? I don't think it will have flown all that far. I don't know what the hell sent us off there either. We were doing pretty good there for a second, and then just all of a sudden, yeah, we were like doing really good, and then we weren't. Alright, is that a hubcap? I don't even know how many I'm missing. That looks like... Oh. <laughs> I think that's actually the sun visor. Where the hell did the hubcaps go? How many did we lose? Let's check that out. Okay, we lost two. Okay, we lost two. We lost the good two. Thank you, autosave. We kept the crappy two. Um, hubcaps? Alright, the crash didn't actually start to... Oh, hi. Crash didn't actually start till after we were past the gas station, yes? I know, just ignore me for a minute, please. Did they end up in this little clump of grass? No, they did not. Is that one? That's not one either. Where the hell did they go? Well, that's a rock, too. Alright, well, I'm gonna keep poking around for a minute, because goddammit, I want four hubcaps on this car. Okay, well, I have to admit, 
I'm stumped. I have no idea where they went. Unless they're stuck in the car somewhere, maybe. I mean, things do get lodged up in here pretty easy. Ah, oh, for God's sakes, autosave. Can't you just go one episode and not, like, molest me? Oh, you know what? I don't see him. Okay, well, we had four hubcaps for <laughs> about four minutes. Ugh. Definitely less than four kilometers. Are there any hubcaps in here by any chance? Nope, but I see a katana. Oh, and some sausages. Am I hungry? I was hungry. Okay, I'm going to poop on the fridge. Don't tell anybody. Oh, hello, an AK. How many bullets? Thirteen? Well, you know what? I can always use more bullets. I don't know how many I've got in my thingy at the moment. Uh, let's see if I can remember how to do this. Okay, that's the first step. Then we have to pick one of these up and reload it off the other one, yes? Oh, it can only hold 30? All right, well, that's fine. I don't need any more than 30 at the moment. There we go. Okay, cool. So it was definitely worth stopping, which is a rarity in these places. All right, that's three revolver bullets. I don't have a revolver, I don't think. I probably do in the back of the car somewhere. I just don't know where it is. You've got gas and oil, so that's completely pointless. You can just go over there and sit on top of the AK. You're blocking the door. Oh, hello, darling. Not that I need you anymore, but I have come to discover the value of having spare cleaning supplies on hand. Uh, oh, yeah, I do have a revolver. It's right there. Okay, I'm just going to put this one kind of there, I guess. Oh, how much water do I have in my water thingy? All right, that's full. That's got 12. I don't need to worry about it. I was debating filling it. Oh, thank you, autosave. But I don't think I'm going to bother because, I mean, it's just a bit of a hassle and, quite frankly, we haven't really struggled to find water. All right, a little bit of oil. Let's get a drink. There we go. Turn that off. We'll have a quick peek up on the roof, see if there's anything exciting up here. See if there's anything up here. Is there anything coming up ahead? Can't tell, wouldn't be able to tell. Anyway, you know what? Let's get the binoculars out. We haven't done this in a while. All right, where's the road? There's my road. Is there anything exciting coming up? Absolutely not. What was that weird thing out in the... Okay, it looks like a bed. It's probably a well. Oh, there's a really, really, really small crappy bus station coming up. I said bus station, gas station. I know what I meant, damn it. All right, well, this place was exciting as anything. I guess it's time to move on. Okay, we do have something here. I was going to say, three boats later that I didn't bother to stop at, we have finally got a parts store. And it's gone all laggy on me, which is usually a good sign that there's plenty of stuff. Now, Christine, deep breath. Okay, you've really got to, like, be a little less skittish today, please. Thank you, autosave. I didn't want to open the door anyway. Oh, hello, we got a Christine door. All right, that's empty. Oh, you know what we never do? We never look at the magazines. So let's take a look and see what's going on. Okay, hello, Janis Joplin. Is the world ending? Scientists are afraid. Interview with the new rock star. All right, what about the other side? Is there anything good on the other side? Okay, it is two-sided. This one has... What's on her mind? Free poster inside. She's probably seriously regretting the rhinoceros tattoo in her armpit. You know, just a guess. And what else do we got? We got bullets. Gas and oil. I got a Christine door. I got another Christine door. This one with a tinted window. Now, if I replace Christine's door, she's just going to have a cow. So there's probably not much point. Okay, empty. Gas, oil, and diesel. So a lot of mixture stuff. Oh, hold on. White wall. All right, no hubcap on the white wall. Is there any good in the back? Oh, that's a really nice... And I have no use for it, but it's a really nice condition tire. Okay, here's a stupid idea. We might try. Let me just park that out there for now. Okay, are you going to stop? Stop rolling. Stop rolling. 
All right, well, if it stays there, we'll try something silly with it. If it doesn't... Oh, I was actually really hungry. Any of you guys got water in you? I could really use some gas and oil. Empty. All right, basically we need white walls. So if you guys got any white walls in here, now's the time to fess up. All right, water, perfect. Okay, apparently I was very thirsty because I just drained that. A little bit of oil, I don't, well, a little bit of something that's going off. Thank you, autosave. I just wanted to see. Okay, yet another Christine door. If we were looking for a door, we'd be minted. Gas and oil again. Is it you I keep spilling? No, it can't be, because you're empty. What is making that noise? All right, white wall with no rim. White wall with no rim. Rim with no white wall. No hubcap either. All right, there goes that bucket. That one's empty. That's got gas and oil in. That, I assume, is a BB gun. Oh, for God's sakes. All right, a bumper. Did we get the driver's door, or are they all... All right, which side of the car was the doors from? All right, that's passenger side. Passenger side. Where'd the other one go? It was over here somewhere. Where did you go? I had you, like, two seconds ago. I just threw you. Oh, that was you. Never mind. Okay. Oh, that one's driver's side. Okay, so we did get two doors and a bumper. I mean, we could pretty much build a Christine if we had to. Get out of the way. I want to know what's over here. Okay, gas and oil. Empty, alcohol, gas and oil. Oh, I see another pseudo-Jeff. Something good under the bed. <laughs> Sudden death is probably under there, so let's not do that. I'll take the brush, though. And a radiator and an engine. Whoop, where'd that brush go? And there is a bat, but I'm pretty sure we have a bat. In fact, I'd be willing to bet we have a bat. We do. That's Bacardi the bat, if anybody's wondering. He does have a name. Alright, you sit in that basket, hopefully kind of like you're supposed to. Alright, you, I wanted to do something dumb with. Oh, hello. Oops, no. Hold still, Rabbit. I'm trying to play soccer with you. Oh, we got it. Not bad for a moving target. Whoops. <laughs> Didn't hurt the rabbit any, but... Oh, well. Swings around about. You can't have everything. Alright, well, as the barren roadway stretches out before me like my finite time before the grave, um, I actually came up with a bit of an idea. I've had plenty of thinking time because there has not been anything to look at on this trip so far since we left the last place. But yeah, it occurred to me that it might be at least mildly interesting, or diverting if nothing else, to try and collect one of every magazine in this game. So, we're going to need another motorcycle basket. I don't know where in the car I'm going to put it. I'm going to take a shot at 120 kilometers an hour. I might be able to put it in the middle here with me. But yeah, we're going to try and collect every single magazine. I don't know how many different ones there are, but it'll be, you know, at least interesting to read them all and kind of see if there's any, like, jokes or anything on the covers. Or maybe they even tie into, like, the backstory of what happened to this place. But anyway, at least it's a new quest, in addition to the hubcaps and license plates. You know, it's always fun to have something new to do. You know, that is assuming we ever see another building in this lifetime. Alright, well, it didn't take that long. There is actually another building coming up, and it looks like it might be a drive-in. Oh, please be a diner. Please, please, please be a diner. And please have lots and lots of cars and license plates and, well, now magazines and fun things to do and distractions and stuff. Pretty, 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 please. Uh, oh, shoot. I did not realize how fast I was going. I don't see anything spawning in. Hello. I say this. Suddenly a bus appears. We do have a car. Oh, God. Okay, look. Stop the car. Out we get. Ah, we're here. Now. What's interesting? Ooh, a little bit of gas. <laughs> Auto save. What? Um. Oh, hello. Really? Wow, Christine didn't waste any time with you. They invite your friends if they want to come play too. Okay, as I was saying, we definitely need a little bit of gas, so. Let's do that. We got a sponge. Alright, what's your license plate say? Your license plate is. Not CQB241. ZLZ721. Hmm. 
Anything good in you? A little bit of diesel. Water, oil, and something else. I'm trying to remember where your fuel tank is. It's right there. You're empty. All right, we got a... You know what? I'm not even going to bother with the spray bottles. I will grab a sponge. But you never know. We might actually find... I'm going to put it here so I can actually have a shot at seeing it later. Oh, we actually got another car out there as well. Oops. Door opens the other way, Digby. Oh, she's in washing the dishes today. I'm not going to bother with any of these bottles, but I do see a bucket. Which is empty, so if I need a drink... Oops, I was trying to grab the door. I actually don't know. Do I need a drink? No, I'm not all that thirsty or hungry. It's not too... Oh, I thought you were doing the dishes. I guess you were cooking. And then good. Lots and lots and lots of cleaning supplies. And a leg. Lots of turds and an arm. Alright, real quick. It's starting to get dark. Nothing in the dumpster, I don't think. What the hell is... What are you? Oh, you're a radio. I don't care about radios. You're a seat. I tell you what, I need a basket, though. So I'll take that. Oh, hat. Looks like there's an engine sticking through the bottom of this dumpster. Let's go put this over next to Christine. Or on her hood, but I'm not going to lose it. Ah, oh, you know what? I'm just going to grab some sleep, so... And that is if autosave will let me. Thank you, autosave. You are such a help. Alright, next day. Now let's have a look up on the roof. Doesn't look like there's much of anything up here. You're a white wall, and it looks like a white wall with a hubcap. It is a white wall with a hubcap. Thank you, I'll take that. Yes, please. I think it's my driver's side ones I'm missing now. Oh, for God's sakes, don't do that. Where'd you go? Come here. No, that's, no, that's bunny ears. <laughs> yep, rabbit ears. I'm gonna have fun finding a picture of that on Google. Okay, well, we had a hubcap. Oh, there it is. Thank God for that. All right, Bunny, don't steal my hubcaps while I'm gone. Please and thank you. Now, what does your license plate say? Is there anything interesting? XLH533. So, the answer to that question was no. I don't see any white wall tires. I don't see any more Christine hubcaps. We do got another can of the uh, dangerously red paint, though. I've actually got two or three in the car now, including the one that actually worked. Well, how about we just numb on that? I'll grab the spray because we can clean up the hubcap we got. Hold on, white wall tire. Survey says no. Okay, is it sprays or sponges I need? I can't remember. You know what? I'll bring the spray and the sponge. Between the two of them, goddammit, I will get this hubcap cleaned up. Okay, it was sponges. Good to know. So you can go down there. You are now mint condition. You can go on the front. We are now missing only one hubcap. I'm going to try and squeeze this in behind Jeff and Mrs. Jeff. I don't know if I'll have any luck, but I'm going to have a go. How about right about there-ish. And now, all we got to do is go around to this side and get it to attach. Preferably without freaking the car out and making it explode. That did not work at all. Can I just drop it? Pick it up in the middle. Oops. And it out. There we go. Perfection itself. Now, having said all that, I wasn't paying attention. Are there magazines in here? Are there ever magazines in here? Not seeing anything in there. Nothing in the kitchen. All right, well, oh, hello. You're an actually intact bus. Oh, that's the luggage compartment, dum-dum. The other side is where everything good goes. Apart from the fuel, which will be here somewhere. That has a lot of oil in it, but little else. Okay, what's in your engine compartment? You've got an intact engine, intact radiator. Hmm. Okay, so the oil's in the fuel tank and the fuel's in the engine. Makes perfect sense. Did not mean to knock that over. More diesel. Alarm clock. More red paint. Okay, we got nothing. I 
I was gonna say flip an autosave again, but I'm getting tired of hearing myself say it. Okay, we do have a magazine. We'll look at you in a second. Oh, revolver I didn't see either. Any more magazines on the shelves? No. Do I need anything else to eat? I saw a roll or something up there. Can I get the roll, please? I just want the roll. Nope, apparently I can't get the roll. Never mind. I thought there's usually fridges in here and stuff. Alright, sorry, other Jeff. Oh, there's something behind the grill. Oh, rebar. Don't need that for anything. I know it's not technically rebar, but... It's easier to say. Oh, hello, water. I do need food, too. Damn it. Alright, well, that little, uh... Oh, there's the fridge. Okay, it was up on the roof. Well, I was gonna say I could take a shortcut, but apparently... The game doesn't want me to game can get stuffed. Oh, tell me that's... How dare you not be a secret white wall with one last hubcap on it that I suddenly discovered by jumping up here. I saw something fall off the fridge. Hello. Is there a reason you freaked out like that? What in the hell is wrong with you? Okay, look. Look. There we go. I just want to open the doors. Okay, one chocolate bar. Can I reach the chocolate bar? I can. It didn't help much. Oh, it was a Jamie Dodger that was on top of it. Alright, why are you such a freakout machine? Alright, well, apparently it's decided to be good now. Oh, we had an orange basket, too, we could have had. I want that roll, damn it. I'm hungry. Oh, wait a minute. Was there something? Ah, never mind. I'll eat this roll. Not eating the turd, though. You know what? That's close enough. Okay, magazine. That's what we were doing. Um... This way? No, I got it upside down. The car is going to be at the bottom, Digby. Thank you, autosave. It's not like I wanted to crouch or anything. Oh, we might get kit interrupted here in a minute. Hold on. All right, sexy something. Sexy motoring, sexy something. I can't read any of that stuff. Oh, hello. All right, interview. I'm assuming that's the word interview in whatever language it's in. Sexy, wild, and free. Now, are you the same girl? No, you don't have a rhinoceros in your armpit. Well, there we go. We got magazine number one, and it's an interview with... Okay, we got Kit interrupted. Yeah, she does not like me doing anything that doesn't involve her. Now, how am I going to get this in this basket? Can I stack them? Will they fit in? It will. Okay, there we go. Magazine number one. Ha! Alright, I think we've got everything we want here, yes? You know what? We can get up on the roof again. Let's just check and make sure I didn't miss any magazines up there. I'm pretty sure... Shut the fuel tank. Thank you. Now, as I was saying, I think we've got everything we need or want from this place. I really wish I had a better, like, one more basket in here just for cleaning stuff. But I think we can make do with what we've got. Oh, you know what? Just toss stuff in. If it gets lost, it gets lost. It's not like they're hard to find. Other I forgot I've got a spare hubcap! I could actually clean this up. Hold up. Yeah, but if we lose this one, we'll ne probably never see another one. You know what? I don't care. I'm cleaning this thing up or throwing it on the car. Hold that thought. Ta-da! We've got a mint condition hubcap. Now, whoops, place your bets on how long we'll get to keep it. I'm not holding my breath. I have a sneaking feeling it'll be gone the next time I cut back from editing. Okay, what just happened? There goes our sponge. There's no rock. We didn't hit anything. And we lost a hubcap. <laughs> oh, no. I'm going to stay in this view and see if I can find... Oh, spray bottle. I'm guessing one of these things glitched out of the bottom of the damn car. Please tell me the hubcap's out in the road somewhere. Or at least somewhere I can see it. Hubcap? How far did we fly? I have no idea. Guess what? I think we've lost the hubcap. Just to tell you how far we made it, there's the diner.
Alright, new cars of... 19... I hear ya. Hello. Hold on, we'll look at the magazine in a minute. Are you gonna stop? You look like you were slowing down there for a minute. Okay, I'll just take that as an... No. I was kind of curious to see if, like, the rabbits and the UFO interact. I don't know if they're going to be any... Anyway, God, he's moving really slow today. I almost feel like we could catch back up. Why are you going so slow? What are you doing? Yeah, usually they're booking it. They're doing like 200 miles an hour. He's legit taking his time. I tell you what. Oh, oh, come on, Digby. Just here. Throw the magazine in the car real quick. Let's see if we can catch up to the aliens. All right, you. We'll look at you in a minute. Come on, I gotta get. I gotta get going. Hopefully, we can catch him. If he hasn't despawned, we might be able to. Okay. There goes something. At a lot of miles per hour. Where did it go? Where did it go? Okay, I know it wasn't the brightest idea I ever had chasing the aliens, but... What the hell came out of my car? Is it a hubcap? Did I lose another hubcap? Well, I didn't lose it, technically. It's right there. Oh, Jesus, Fred. You just jumped the crap out of me. Okay, look. Everybody calm down. And by everybody, I mean me. Okay, radio. Back in. There you go. Weird... Periwinkle glove box. You get back on. There you go. Hubcap that, you know, for reasons just decided to stop there. On you go. Did I lose any more of them? All right, we got all the headlights. We're missing a mirror. Oh, for God's sakes, auto save. Now? Now you want to do this to me? I have no idea where the mirror went. I have no idea what caused the crash. Um, why did you suddenly just appear? Please don't suddenly appear. You guys are enough friggin' crap. To do. I'm assuming some of the random cleaning supplies went crazy. So I tell you what. I'm gonna go back and look for the mirror really quick just because I have OCD and that's kind of my vibe. Plus I'm kind of curious to see if there is anything we actually hit. Are you the mirror? That's something. Are you my mirror? It is my mirror. Never mind. Look at that. We didn't have... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bad idea. Yeah, we didn't have to travel very far for that at all. That works for me. No. Missed it. There you go. Alright, we're back. We got three hubcaps. I don't know if they're the same three we started with, but... We're back. We got three hubcaps. Oh, you know what? Let's take a break. Let's read the magazine. Then we can sort it out properly. Okay, what did you have to say? You had to say... Alright, new cars of 77, the sexiest girl of 77. Can't tell if it's the same one, because I can't see her armpit. <laughs> Alright, what to do if your girl dies in your car? A weird... what? A weird red dot has been spotted on the moon? Huh? Getting to know your engine. Some people stopped eating meat. Are they afraid that the world is going to end? I would assume not, but then what do I know? And on the back, it's just, a storm is coming, and I can't read the... Okay, it says something at the bottom that's really cute. It's one of those, if you're reading this. If you're reading this, have an awesome day. <laughs> okay, well, now I'm kind of curious if there is actually a little red spot on the moon. There's a little red spot on the moon. Because I always sleep at night, and I only see the moon go overhead at about a million miles an hour. So I'm thinking, I was going to end this episode wherever we stop next, but I'm thinking I might actually record a little late, stay up for the whole night, or at least half of the night till the moon shows up, and see if it's actually got a little red spot on it. Alright, well I didn't realize how fast the moon travels, but as far as I can tell, no, there is no little red spot on the moon. The, oh, whoops, I've apparently run out of ability to go further back, so we're going to have to go this way now. Yeah, no, it just looks like a plain old big silver ball to me. Well, that's kind of a shame. I was really hoping that might be like an Easter eggy thing. And on that note, I think we're going to leave this one here. So, as always, I have been Digby. I thank you guys for stopping by. I'm really glad you guys are enjoying the long drive. And yeah, I hope to see you for the next one.
Yeah.